Hey folks, this is Gazwan Kari over at SharePointQuester.com. Today we'll be going over configuring managed metadata. If your organization has decided to take advantage of the many benefits of managed metadata service, the task to get the managed metadata configured is fairly simple. We're going to follow five different tasks. The first one will be assigning term store administrator. The second one will be creating the group, the term set, and the terms. The third one will be adding a managed metadata column to a list to see the terms in a list. And then for a task, the fourth task will be adding items and start leveraging the managed metadata uh, as we create these items. And then finally, we'll make sure it's easier for users to find the managed metadata through the navigation on the under Quick Lounge. So let's go ahead and get started. I switched to my central administration or I launched my central administration. Um, I select application management within application management under service applications. I'm going to select manage service applications and then managed metadata service within here. The first thing I'm going to do again is to configure my term store administrators. And for that, I'm going to plug in my administrator in here and go ahead and save this information. The second task is to create the group, the term sets, and the terms. So uh, let's go ahead and create a group. This is going to be my organization. And then within the organization group, we're going to create a new term set. And this is going to be department. And then within department, we're going to create the different terms. This will be finance, IT, legal and then marketing. So uh, this is all done. Let's port this over to uh, the list. Let's start leveraging this in the list. So I'm going to go to my site and under my site, I'm going to create a new custom list. This custom list will be uh, help desk tickets. We'll go ahead and create the list and we're going to start adding columns to this list. So the first column we'll add will be uh, technician and this is going to be person or group people to choose from and we'll say OK. We are going to add another column and this is going to be now department. And this is going to be a managed metadata. And under the term set settings, we're going to go ahead and leverage what we have. So we've got organization department and we'll go ahead and say, OK. And then we're going to add a third uh, uh, column in here and we're going to say this is the type. So ticket type. I'll call it ticket type. And this is going to be also a managed metadata. But in this case, we're going to dynamically add it through here. So this is going to be a custom term. And then uh, we're going to go ahead and edit the term set. Make sure it shows up in here. And this is what we're going to leverage. Make sure that the submission policy is open and this is all good. We're going to go ahead and close this window. Now we've got four different columns. Two of them are managed metadata. One of them is porting directly from what we've created earlier under central administration. So let's create a new item. This will be password reset for Outlook. And uh, this is Marion Smith. And the department here, let's browse and choose finance or if you want you just start typing and it will remit it will try try and find a match it'll give you a suggestion and then the ticket type this will be for example uh, authentication authentication and if i click enter it's not recognizing it because because it doesn't have that term so we're going to come in here and add a new item and this will be authentication and then let's select this. It becomes recognized and it, it will take it now. So let's just add another item in here. Reboot issue. 
this is again Marion Smith the department is uh, IT sounds good and then the ticket type is uh, server related and see if uh, we're gonna add this as well because it's not there so this is authentication server related we'll go ahead and select that go ahead and click OK and go ahead and save so this is all good now we're gonna give the users the ability to see uh, a better navigation to get to be able to get to this content so let's go under list settings under list settings there is a metadata navigation setting in here we're gonna add the department and we're gonna add the ticket type we're gonna get rid of folders we don't want that and the rest of it is all good we'll go ahead and click OK now if I go to help desk tickets you're gonna notice under the navigation I've got a better way to navigate through my uh, term sets and through my terms so if I want to see anything that's finance related I just click on finance and you're gonna see that the information appears in here if I want to see anything that's server related as far as ticket type goes then I will see that one issue that Marion Smith reported in here this concludes this video thanks for listening in